Hi everyone, today we're going to be colouring these. Um, I think these are runner beans. There are different types of beans. You might think they're broad beans, they're French beans, but I think they're runner beans. That's how I'm going to be colouring them. Now, the runner beans vary a lot in colour from the photos that I'm looking at. I don't think it's that the colour varies, I think it's the photos vary. But I'm going to start with the earth green yellowish from my polychromo set and just do the same colour across the whole bean to start with. Just a light layer as we've done on a lot of these vegetables. Just getting a base colour down. I don't know how much you can see, there we go. These are a little bit darker green but I thought we'd start with a paler one and build up some colour. Now some of them are more vibrant green than this but it as I say it seems to depend on the picture so we'll see my mum always used to grow runner beans she had did last summer actually I think I'm not sure if she's going to this summer or not she couldn't decide really she said they didn't taste much better than the shops it was a lot of effort with watering and looking after them they weren't they felt that actually buying them was more um, economical um, permanent green olive I'm going to have a go at um, although they don't get metered for their water I'm going to do a little bit at each end of the stem they, uh, there's still all the effort of watering them um, for this little hat bit I don't know what this is they don't really have this so I'm just going to do a little bit on the edge just a faint bit I don't want too much because I want to do some down here as shadow because it's sort of overhanging the top of the bean isn't it it's going to be some shadow underneath it like that now I'm going to do a line down the side of each you've seen me do this a lot if you've been following um, me doing this page by doing a line along the edge each side we can start to give the impression that they're slightly rounded so although beans aren't terribly rounded they're not completely flat so I'm going to just scumble that in a little bit to sort of blend it into the green that's already there. We nearly finished this page now. It's pop I bet it feels like it's taken ages because I've been spreading these um, videos out quite a bit across the days. It's because I needed a lot of content across the summer while the children are on holiday few plans for different content for the summer. It's uh, difficult for me to, um, I may have already started releasing it, it may not have worked, I may not have done it, but um, I have got um, articles on my website so those are worth having a quick look at. Right, now we have given a slight impression of um, that they're not completely flat. I'm going to go back in with my earth green yellowish and just bring in this darker edge colour a little bit more towards the centre. I'm going to leave a little, little paler bit. They're not shiny shiny which is why we haven't left any white which would make them look almost metallic but they do catch the light a little and hopefully by just adding that little bit of darker colour it might just give that impression and that is it it's really simple today just a few minutes of coloring and we've got those lovely tasty looking beans done so thank you very much for watching um, i hope you enjoyed it and have a happy coloring day